of that thing back to a latura. Oh, Tisha, of that thing back to a latura. Oh, Tibo, oh, Tibo, Jawaja, oh, Tibo, Lawaro, Kojeki, Agbabati, Adura. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus, hallelujah. Welcome, welcome to the year 2023. Happy, happy new year. Welcome to a very, very good year. Praise be the name of the Lord, hallelujah. I bring you a message, I bring you an instruction for the year 2023. I bring you a message from the Spirit of the Living God. I bring you a message from Akiri Shere, the good doer God, Jesus, the good doer God, by His Spirit. And the instruction is, he said, lay aside every weight and sin which does easily beset us. He said to work with me year 2023. He said to tell you to lay aside every weight. And he said, what's one thing that is profound, that is instructive? He said to tell you that you do not even need to think about it, to think it. He said he should speak it out. He wants to hear the weight. That you are dropping off. He said he wants to hear it. He wants to hear you say it. He wants to hear you say it. He wants to hear you say it. Because with the mouth, we confess our sins. He said, I want to hear you say that weight that you are dropping, that you are dropping, that you're dropping at the feet of the Father this year. Every weight that you know that has easily beset you, every weight of sin, every weight of doubt, every weight of fear, Every weight of sickness, every weight of disease. He said, drop it at the feet of the Father. I dropped mine. Praise be the name of the Lord. I dropped mine. He said, there will not be any endurance. There will not be any endurance between me and you. I don't want any endurance between you and me. In this year, 2023, he said to drop it. Say it, say it, say it, say it, say it in front of the Father. Say it in your time of prayer. Say it as you're listening now. Say it, he wants to hear. Praise be the name of the Lord. And he said, when you drop, he said, when you drop this weight, praise be the name of the Lord. When you drop this weight, he said, there shall be great reversals. There shall be reversals. And reversals mean restoration. Praise be the name of the Lord. And what I want to employ you to do is do not even ask for that reversal that you need. That you think you need. Because that reversal, that, that thing might have been, it might have been for your good. Just say, Lord, let your will be done according to the reversals that you are giving me. So that you will not pray amiss. <laughs> because you know the spirit searches all things. Hear the deep things of God. The spirit knows all things. So just say, Lord, according to your will, let it be done according to that reversal that you that you know that I qualify for. Be it unto me. And everything will be restored back to you. He said, I will restore the years. I will restore everything that the Pama and the caterpillar has eaten up. I will restore it to you. There shall be great reversal. But one thing you should do first is to bring to him, lay down every weight that you know will hinder your work with God this year. Lay it down. He wants to help you. He wants to take it away. Lay it down. Lay it down. Lay it down so that you can walk into your restoration. So that you and I can walk into our restoration. We can walk into our river. We can take back our great reversal. And the Holy Spirit said one thing profound again. From the book of Isaiah 65. 24. He says this year when you do accordingly. When you lay aside this way. When you walk with me powerful. In this year 2023. He said, before you answer, before you call, I will answer. According to the book of Isaiah 65, 24. Before you call, I will answer. And while you yet speak, I will hear you. I will hear you, says the Lord. I'm so excited about this year, 2023. 
because I've laid aside every weight and welcome. Let your eyes be focused on the Father. Let your eyes be focused solely on God. Don't worry about anything that's happening around you. Focus. Focus. Lay it at the feet of Jesus and focus mightily on the Father. The scripture, I don't know the word that you have received for this month or for the year 2023. But I have received mine and I'm working with it. And in mine is Galatians, Galatians chapter 2, 20, which is for the ministry as well, the Akimoshore ministry. So we are working childlike, powerful with the Father. Because Christ is in us and is dispensing his power through us in year 2023. Hallelujah. The instruction is drop the weight. And the result of dropping the weight is there will be great reversal. There will be restoration. And you will be among those that before you call he answers. And before while you yet speak, God hears you. God hears me in the supreme and matchless name of Jesus Christ. It is my prayer for you that you encounter Akivishore Jesus, the good to our God, all through this year in the name of Jesus. Akivishore means the one who goes about to do good according to the book of Acts 10, 38. While God anointed Jesus with the Holy Ghost and with power, and from then on Jesus went about to do good praise be the name of the lord it is my prayer that you continually encounter him all the days of your life all throughout all through this year and all the days of your life in jesus mighty matchless name amen and amen the message has been delivered and it is for you to obey and adhere to it in jesus name receive grace to obey receive grace to drop every weight so that you can be free to walk solely with the father this year in jesus name hallelujah happy happy new year welcome 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 to the year that you walk powerful with god welcome to a very good year amen and amen